Welcome to J Paint. I hope you enjoy our video. Thanks for watching. For today's video, I used the color blue kazoo, English navy, licorice black, yellow deep, white, harvest orange, and apple red. For our background, I used the colors blue kazoo and English navy. I started with our blue kazoo, then without cleaning off my brush, switched to English Navy, blending the two together, and continued with that process all the way to the bottom of the canvas. Once my background dried, I then went in with the white paint and painted a circle closer to the lower left corner of the canvas. Once my circle dried, I then went in with my paintbrush and dipped half of it in the red apple and the other half in the yellow deep to give us two colors on our paintbrush and then went in and created my flames. Once I did a couple of flames with the red paint and the yellow paint, I then went in and used a different paintbrush, dipping it in the yellow deep and the harvest orange to create more flames in other areas to make it seem like one big flame coming out of my circle. For this next part, I just continued to use the same brush that I used in the orange and the yellow and overlapped some of the flames using all three colors just to give it more of a flame-like appearance. By overlapping, it allows you to blend some of the colors together in certain areas to make the flame stand out a little bit more. Once I completed the flames, I then went in with a small pointed paintbrush with the red apple and painted lines on the circle to turn it into a baseball.
Once I finished my lines on the baseball, I then cleaned that brush off and used it with the black paint to outline my baseball. I then went in with the black and added some detail lines to the flame just to make it stand out a little bit more. I then went in with a thicker pointed paintbrush to just add some details to the outside of my flame with the remaining yellow, orange, and red that I had. Once you've finished your small details, don't forget to sign your painting and this is what your finished product should look like. If you would like to purchase a kit to paint this painting at home, check out my website at jpaint.square.site. As always, thanks for watching and remember to like and subscribe to our channel to check out more videos and don't forget to hit that notification bell so you can always get an update when our new videos are posted.